Well, one invasive carp species is taking over rivers in the U.S. and is now moving into Tennessee. News 12's Kaylee Nix shows us how the Tennessee Aquarium is encouraging folks to help cut down on these numbers. From Mississippi to Tennessee, rivers are being overrun with Asian silver carp. There's just thousands and thousands of these Asian carp, silver carp in particular, and they just stress out the native fishes because there's just so many of them. Biologists at the Tennessee Aquarium have been studying the invasion of fish and the toll that it takes on local ecosystems by crowding river space and altering the food chain. Um, when these silver carp eat huge amounts of plankton, they literally take food away from our native species. TVA has partnered with the aquarium to monitor the migration of the fish into the Tennessee River system. Both groups are educating people on ways to help reduce the number of fish in the river. We can actually find uh, ways to you know, limit their population like commercial fishing and bow fishing tournaments and or hopefully we can have a, a acoustic barriers where we can keep them from going through the lines. Most people think of carp as a dirty fish, but at an event today, Chef Tammy Cook was proving that making the fish delicious is easier than expected. It's one of the easiest fish I've ever cooked. It takes, it has a very neutral flavor and it takes on the flavor of whatever you put on it. And you can also cook it in a variety of ways. We're frying it today. It tastes like no other fish I've, I've had. And I've been doing this event at the aquarium and developing um, recipes with fish for 10 years now. And I've never tasted a fish that's as clean tasting as this one. Reducing the number of carp in the river is also important because they can be dangerous to recreational activities. In Chattanooga, Kaylee Nix, News 12 Now.